Hi, hi. Good evening. Hi, my father, Francis, how are you? Linepa, how are you? Ba Alice Banda Mulishani, Francis Ilunga, how are you? Ba Yuri Moiseni Mulishani. Have to situate my camera, guys. I'm not in the office, so how are you? How are you guys? So waiting for Mamachka Monique. Sex scandals topic by Prince Mulishan. Sha, how are you? How are you? We are here to talk about the sex scandal, you know, the death of the couple. Ah, Mandini. This is a scandal of the century. Ah, Zambia. Mm -mm. Scandal after scandal, we are tired. We are waiting for Mama to join us. Sad day. Grace, how are you? Gladys, how are you? We are good, we are good. Bye, my. Scandal after scandal, people. Twanaka. Good evening, Bayuri. Good to see you. Thank you for always joining. And Imon Mondo, hi Imon. Share as you are joining. By well, Maximilian Mulishani, all the new followers, welcome, welcome. Good to have you on the page. Ask you to, to share as you join. You know, there is interference, there is a censorship of some of these pages with divergent views they are being censored so we ask you to share as you join so many people can watch us they don't get notifications so if you can share in the groups you know you know is the new norm of a new dawn governance there's a lot of censorship on the pages so our reach is limited and 
also share and like Munechita like if you are not liking then uh, Facebook won't be able to share the the page so as you join Chitena ma like ma like so that Facebook can boost yes Munechita ma like ma la you know uh, be uh, be liking loving or whatever let's be interactive if we are interactive then facebook can boost the page even if they are blocking it so as you come in guys try to like 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 share 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 i'm letting you feel my like <laughs> not to my heart send me the hearts the likes yes guys mule liking because you know um the ama algorithm you have facebook they work off of the the positive feedback so as you are liking sharing to my emoji post especially i'm like you know if you uh, uh, it doesn't matter how if you're the same person it doesn't matter so like like share love to my heart sphere like thumbs up then uh, the algorithm yaba facebook will be able to to be sharing the page because then the, it will pick it that people are liking what we are talking about but uh, if, if you are just watching no comment then facebook so as you come as we are talking make sure you are liking and uh, hitting like then facebook will see that okay this page is liked even if we are followers but if you are not liking or sharing then Facebook won't be able to promote the page. So we are just asking you, Mulechita ma like, Fidia. Mulechita like, share, whatever, do something, comment something, then algorithm, you have a Facebook. Joseph, you have a mumma light. So our Facebook can able to tell if there is heavy interaction that this page is liked and they can promote our page. So even if you are watching, but uh, you are just quiet, then uh, but facebook wala tubika kukona wala tubika kuwaya so guys share as you come in like ama thumbs up utuma comment utuma emoji let's be interactive yes so today la mama she's supposed to join here but uh, you know what's happening good evening much poesh sanga good to see you long time yeah but costly moya good to see you we are talking about this uh, the double you know double tragedy the key the murder murder of the wife and suicide of the husband is really sad and we're just here to say this man should be put on uh, the suspension a uh, state house should not be quiet because this is a minister is a high-ranking official state house should not be quiet they should come in and uh, suspend the minister pending investigation yeah so this minister need to be on suspension and we need to have a statement from from the from a government spokesman you know we can't be having scandals in the government and then the government is quiet no you know we can't be having scandals under the government Murder and suicide is big cases. The government can't be quiet. He need to be suspend, suspended to pave way for investigation. That's point number one. that minister need to be suspended like yesterday it's long overdue why is state house quiet good evening back is it or good to see you thank you much poya good evening good evening guys so my likes simulate liking a my separate page so that facebook can pick the algorithm and promote our page as you come on the page let's share like in our share let's be interactive yes if you're dead so about facebook they won't promote our page so as you come in the page please be liking sharing commenting say something uh 
the the law is not yet active you know the in, independent broadcasting act the changes they want to make they are not yet active so you guys there is no need for you to be scared of anything you know is a act of intimidation and the way the things are the parliament will not pass that law because it has to go to parliament and it has to be approved and even the upnd members of parliament they are opposing this iba act so by them just saying that they want to implement this they have won already without even a law it's just intimidation you know so we have to know our right and stand our ground no it's illegal and it's not, not the law yet mm -hmm. and uh, our freedom of speech are enshrined in the universal declaration of human rights article number 19 you know that's why we have global platforms such as this one where we can all come and talk because we are protected by those rights yes so earlier she go but i'm waiting for mama to join in but on the double murders i want to say that the state house must come in and make a statement and the minister might be put on a forced leave pending investigation until he's cleared yes so that minister need to be put on a, on a, on a forced leave suspension pending investigation that needs to be done as soon as possible and then the other thing by gladys mulelanda gladys you talk about moral decay i just want to tell the young people that you know young people this the, the lady this couple i'm sure there are many people in that situation right now because these young girls they are after money you know they are selling their soul to the devil and they are married and they are dating men who have money you know so let this be a learning point what i want to say about this i know we are in mourning but usually when things happen is a time when people must learn their lesson Apa while you while you have a young husband you are cheating on your husband it's just a matter of time if you're a young lady and you are dating somebody who has money to sponsor your expensive lifestyle it's a time bomb because sooner or later that bomb will explode and it will explode in a bad way look at what has happened to our young our young lady there brutally murdered by her husband so to somebody let us be content with what we have meanwhile you are cheating on your husband or your wife if you're not happy in your marriage just leave no one is forcing you when you cheat if into things don't end well when you are cheating on somebody things don't end well hmm? Even lesson, could you situation in it? These people, we can't even laugh at them because we know that a lot of Zambian women they are cheating on their men, they are cheating on their husbands. A lot of Zambian men they are cheating on their wives. Exactly, but Maximilian, the UPND government needs to lead by example. And they fall and enforce it, you know, a standard. What is, is that? What, what word can I use? But we don't call it by example, moral standard. They need to have a, a high moral standard by UPND. Mm -hmm. But back in the morning, but I shall never remember when I was you poor, umul more better, one more temoir, more chef. Yeah, don't be cheating because you have my problems. You have my problems. You have my problems. You have my problems. Hello, number. The room I left. The other news is that you have my room. 
ati ale fa yoku ya ipa ya uri ya wini umwa umwa wenda nangu. Ero no mbaka tuishifia chitike, amu chinkula, uri ya wini umwa umwa amu chinkula. Number what happened, the, the man was ready to kuya mkuipa ya umwa 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 so these are dirty games. Tule ni funda bakashana ikale ni fie. Techuwe na upwa from there wa shomu mwe munga nda mwe. Wa mkula la no mwa ume umbi. What is that? Eh? Na mwabe neba lumendo. If you are not ready to marry, mwila upa. Techi, wabe neba minister bali kwa taba kashi. Wa shaba kashi wabe munga nda wa mfuaya muka mwini. What is that? Hmm? If you number one, if you interfere, pen a number. If you interfere, pen a because behavior, people's behavior, they, they are doing things they should not be doing. I know, you know Mozambia, we come from a culture, I am paddy. You never need to advise a valumendo. A valumendo, you want to bring another wife, you do it in the normal way, like traditionally, quite impali. Quite impali traditionally, I want to buy a parika. No, nobody in the want to buy a parika. No, but uku parika. Kuya for a few mukasha no li single. Watuara nensa mumu for a no mukashu wobe mukashu wani nende for uku parika. Mumu for na wino wino watuara no mukashu wemu asumi ni shania parika. Why Look at the Senegalese president. The Senegalese president is going into White House with two wives. Again, if that man wants to bring a third wife, Let us be honest in our dealings. We come from a culture yampani. If it is about the number, the situation ya the mukashan abavantu abavana bafuire temporary wuchen de is just wuchen de obule. Dirty is just nasty behavior. We muntu ali upa wa yamkula na mukamui. A young, a young whatever. I don't think Mukuruna in. He's a young man. But because of lust, because of money, whatever reasons, these people, but they shall have a cash man. They have a cash man. They have a cash man. Because they have a cash man. They have a cash man. They have a cash man. Ministers destroying families. You people in government. Kale mwaya mbide na mama machila landa. You people in government, instead of using that money to help the vulnerable, why don't you help all the, 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 the vulnerable like my orphans? I'm orphanage, a street kids, very full of people. Why can't these ministers take all this extra money and help the vulnerable? The disabled are there. You stabak wa ten chito. Why can't they donate all this money? See? They are using for prostitution and breaking people's homes and causing suicides and murders. Why can't they take this money and they put it in to help people? Fund by a youth kwambaka project, wambama companies in Zambia. Hmm? But, but instead, I want to go to the PFU by Richter. Kuya Mkula Fuaya by Che. Kula Fuaya by Che, buying homes for these young girls, buying vehicles for these young girls, instead of investing that money or helping the vulnerable in, in our country. Let's say, to are to panic here. Ima wema ministers, kwa mba fikuli ba PF, all the money kafine, you know like ine wala njita panu wati ni nevo slay queen waba PF. I've never been a, 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 in PF, 
let alone have no one has ever funded me from pf in pf shall pf shall yapo not even a penny i have never shall yapo or a penny about pf our lady in pf shall pf body she but we are here to say this trend is continuing these ministers these people when they come in government they are stinking rich instead of using that money to the money vale panga kuma deals and whatever my contracts why can't they donate to orphanages or help by youth fund my cooperative start companies but instead bale amkufaya ba mukabe ni abaiche either ba mukabe ne or wabaiche young vulnerable children they are spending millions of quarters and dollars on young women who are married or single, destroying marriages, and now you can see info about to now for. Nishbach, so, so in Zambia, really, we need the government to step up. We need the Ministry of Religious Affairs to come back. We need the Kachinga Kwa Department of Culture, where we have We need to reinforce and buckle up on our culture. Our culture, we are polygamous, yes. We are polygamous, yes. And if we are a polygamous culture, let us tell our young men to marry second or third wives according to our culture, not if it is chitika. Zambian, if I'm a half Tonga and a half Lozi, I have uncles Zala for temporary right now, as we speak so. I have uncles right now who have three, four, five wives. So we need the Department of Culture, whatever, to direct these young men what they need to do if they need to, to take a second, third, or fourth wife. This thing of messing up cheating here and there now mumona aids hiv numbers are skyrocketing aids and hiv would watch it up on way to back with and the government cannot be quiet because this is about moral behavior this is about a health risk Zambia is already a hotspot for HIV, HIV, HIV and AIDS. And if the ministers themselves are in a center of sex scandals, then what example are we setting for the country? What example are we setting? So anyway, I won't be here long. I'm just here to say, you know, I'm really disappointed that uh, you know this trend of prostitution the immoral behavior has continued from pf now it is even worse it is even worse in you in you doing government we thought things would be different and you know why these people now they are taking a, the 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 law in their hands because the courts are compromised if you are a, if you take a rich person to court, you won't get your justice. Hmm? That's why you want to number because now we should think court. They won't get their justice. The courts are compromised. Rich people getting away with anything. Oh, akwata fi mpia tapali mulando ba alampere umupina that's why number you know people are taking this man who killed his wife and killed himself if if there was justice in the zambian courts he would have gone to court but he knows that maybe they'll even end up creating a case implicating him and arresting him instead this is what's happening in zambia So it's really sad, guys. It's a sad state of affairs.
But this is a warning. Bakashana, be warned. Be warned, Bakashana, isungeni. Greediness, ukutemwe mpia, ukutemwe fiuma. Hmm? No. Mulishani, ba, 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 John, good to see you. I mean, I'll share a personal story. Pana tulela anda, tatulela anda, fetu alika pitamu. Nana, I'll share my personal story. So, for me, I've been through it. I've been through a cheating spouse. And I can talk about it because this happened 30 years ago when I was a young wife. When I was a young wife, cheating happened and what did I do? I didn't take the law in my hands. Of course, if you are dealing with the infidelity and faithful spouse, you seek help. You go counseling to church, family members in the community. And I did all that. When I was faced with a cheating situation in my own personal life, I tried it. Counseling, church, community, family, it didn't work out. And then I moved on. That is 30 years ago. And that marriage, I had three children from that marriage. No, by imagining, how would have my children survived losing both par parents in such a horrible manner? Eh? Is not the solution where our youth is not a solution to kill somebody when they are cheating on you. Just walk away. You are creating more problems. Like Mama and Omba, this is a national problem. This is a national problem because of two people who were cheating, two people have lost lives, and all the families they are affected, and the children are forever damaged. The children will be traumatized for life. Bakala ve seka ku school e e uyuba nina badi ve pa ya bale chito muri awa na kulia kulia ba ya ba share ba na ba minister na ba na ba ba they are affected. You know it's a big big thing. So my point here is, if you are involved, you can't control people's actions. People will cheat anyway if they want to cheat, but. Uh, Move on. Try to save the marriage. If the marriage is insolvable, move on. There is life after cheating. There is life after divorce. Good evening, Bakari. Don't take someone's life because he was cheating on you or whatever. Do not do it. It is a curse. If someone is cheating on you, try to work it out. If it doesn't work out, go your way. You don't have a right here to your Ulele tama problem, pachal. And you curse your entire family and generations to come. Me, mm -hmm. I walked away from a cheating situation. Here I am 30 years ago. 30 years ago, I walked away. It was not easy. There were three children there and it was a 10-year marriage. I walked away. So you need to talk to people and understand that if you're in a cheating situation, you have options. And the killing somebody is not an option. You cannot kill somebody. A lot of you are in that situation of this couple, but I'm here to advise you, Kwebati. Ukwipa yo muntu test, uriya muntu nishtari wove, wachipati kishefye. This is my, my point here that I want to, to teach. Because sometimes when you, you meet someone, you think you are in love, there are the warning signs that that is not really your person. Because even me, like I, I told you, I was I left a marriage because of cheating. 
But when I look back, there were warning signs to La Patricia. This is one thing I want to teach now. Nkalaisa panwande mi fundava youth. Ngawakumanyo muntu ama warning signs yala bapo. Panabakadeka silent voice. Something is telling you that this is not the one for you. But ule patikisha maishiba. Tula patikisha. So let us learn to, to seek God's face when we are making decisions to choose a partner. Do not rush. Do not be in a hurry. Tuilabu tukila. Wana fio mwa ume. Awa ine ni uyu. Ni uyu inefetu wala. Upana mapisha no buinga. Yeah? Six months. One year. No. Take your time. Wana fio mwa na kashi. Awa ine tu wala. Upana ni uyu ine. No. Take your time. Seek God's face. Mutu wale kuli babulu. Bobe bonse. Baya babu mwone mwa na kashi. Nangu mwa ume ulia. E mwa. Do your due diligence because marriage, marriage once you are bringing families together, you are uniting spirits of two families. So you have to know whom you are marrying and what you are marrying. And, and take your time, don't be desperate. And if you have any doubt, Think twice. Sit down and think. Take a to kill a fear. Yo, na la upo mapshano winga. Do you know what you are really marrying? Make sure you do a background check. Make sure you know the person. You know what we uh, but, but Jonas if and if you have in PF and the current situation, Zambia is not about PF or UPND. Zambia is bigger than PF and UPND. These two parties, the people who voted for them, they are less than 50% of the Zambian population. We are talking about what's wrong and what's right. This is the measure we are going to use to rule this country. We are not going to rule this country because we are PF village to Wupuba, na ba UPND village to Wupuba, so Wupuba butwari lire. No, that is not the way we are going to run the country. We are going to run the, the country on the truth and justice and the wrong or right. This is how you run the country. You run the country on a bedrock of truth, wrong and right. You don't use a measure of a failed government to come and validate your failure as well. Nishwala Luba as a country. So we as Zambia need to stand on neutral ground and see between all their failures. If PF was failing, they were failing. If UPND was failing, it's still a failure. We can't say because PF was failing, Navabe never failing, it's okay. No, we are going nowhere. And this, this is the problem of this country because you always come and compare Bullshit to bullshit. Garbage in, garbage out. No. We have to draw the line and stand on the truth. And the truth will set us free. It is right or wrong. Chapwa. If PF was on the right side, on the wrong side of history, that's why they are out of government. And if UPND is doing the same, very soon I will never want them. Niva one temu na bena. Uyoma bumbanga di fudi de fia kwe fio. Wabana bena bale fula wa cosmos whatever ba yabale. You know, public, you know what? You're twali kwa tama private parts. That's why tula tula fuale fia kwa fuala. Yeah? That's 
why we are human beings. Taturinge finamefia mumpangawe. The human mind is the only mind that has been evolving. Mumo nefina mama elephant fia diwa fika la fia mumpanga. Since the beginning of time, elephants and all the wild animals fia la mumpanga. If we at one time we lived like those animals, but we have evolved to live in houses, to, to look at our life now. We are in a digital age from Stone Age, Iron Age, Ice Age, all those time zones. No, but we are in a digital age. We live in homes, we dress up, you know. We have private parts, that's why they are called private. What is a private part? So immediately you take a camera and start recording your private part. Just know that anything you put on a digital media is no longer private, it's public. So whatever mudala kashinga niwa nani, doing phone sex no mwa iche, balipa camera, immediately you take, the, even me, immediately I come live and turn on my camera, it's public. That's why I have to watch what I say, I have to be politically correct, I have to watch my appearance, how am I looking, how are people, how do people perceive me when I come, you know, because immediately I switch on my camera, I'm public, even if it's one person watching here. It's still public. Bedroom yandineka, nambo kula kopa ma private parts. The minute I do that, the minute I take a digital gadget, now I am educating you. Some of these people don't know. The minute you take a camera and start recording anything, it becomes public because anyone can hack into that phone. Not necessarily even hack in your phone. They can scan phone from a distant location. And anything that is on your phone, they can have access to it. FLH ticker. So you have to be aware how these gadgets work. So anything actually on a gadget is public information. Because it's stored on the world in the world wide web on the internet. WhatsApp operates via internet, Wi-Fi. So the minute, even if you love a girl, if you can't see that girl, for your own safety, don't. Immediately you are having phone sex, guess what? It's the whole world. Guess what? Guess what? That is a public record. And anyone in the world, the 7 billion people in the world can watch you what you are doing so you need to be educated you know keep your private parts private you have no business taking a picture of your private part on your camera because you once you know that you do that have a picture private part you wish you were my longa wabu kawasanga picture you were in viral wika papa don't be shocked to me especially if you have a lot of enemies they will use that back in get my phone i'm a phone yes so let i'm educating you i'm a phone if you're setting up my phone the public is public data so Already people already are scanning my phone. They know what's there. But the day, but I scan every day. This is what happens. People scan, scan your phone every day to see any juicy content. So now you know we never scan up. 
Balaskana phone and to see what what scandal can we put Pumolo in? They are scanning my phone day and night. Kwa fati ba sange muli scandal. So you have a phone wambo kula ikopa ma private part. Guess what? You have just given your enemies ammunition to bring you down. Now can you imagine Ilya scandal Ilya? Yeah, bam dala but then AK forty seven having phone six can you imagine how damaging that is he's a grown man he has children he has grandchildren he has got i don't know how many wives his families his relatives his career they are all seeing his private parts actually like there, there is a woman here in my neighborhood and it wasn't a phone sex it was actually a video they were in a hotel They were in a hotel, but they were phone sexy. Somehow, the, somebody uh, scanned her phone and lit their phone sex uh, uh, tape. On the internet, she was a married woman and he was a married man. For sex tape, yeah, we actually catch your body. But yeah, but somebody uh, hacked the phone. Yeah, Kwana Mayo. But I send the tape. You know, the woman almost committed suicide. She was a married woman with grown children, and somebody lit the tape and put it on Facebook. Not here, but group. Facebook. You know? The woman was on on suicide on suicide watch. So, atansio, nalanda na I won't be here for long. But you think a question? Just know from today, nalanda you say digital footprint never goes away. Anything you put on camera is public record. So don't even dare. Ngamula. Because the day you create enemies, they don't get more politics. But I, I'm a politicians, they, they're always screwing each other. But I took a ballet, took a but oh, if you're to let's check his phone. What scandal? What can we do to scandalize him? Mulebe man, I'm a fiashiven, we're a bit of a issue, you know. Some of these old school people, now our parents cell phone ni danger. They don't know that that cell phone can it damage and ruin somebody's life. Not only his life, his family. Number one, in AK forty seven. Imagine all his children, his family. Hello, he was even a high profile politician. Eh? Diplomatic pole, but saving up on a moon a mufialo. Can you imagine? Kukosa. So, Eddie, I should you want to back this. But we just pray for the families of the two, the young couple. We pray for the families. You know, God be with them. It's a tough time, you know. Bahaka Inde and his government, they need to put their foot down. You know, this is a very serious case. Infaya Muntu is 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 a is a is a public thing. So under the circumstances surrounding this death are so bad, you know. It's really bad. So if you may want to bakwale, sir. God bless you. We'll talk on Monday with interesting topics. Let me just see what comments are here. Thank you, by Francis Natotela. Let me just read your comments. Thank you, by Francis. Yeah. We were not, not born yesterday. But thank you. Yeah. Yep.
all right guys good night thank you for watching have a good weekend bye